folks, it's Barry here. Welcome to my Virgin Kitchen. It's the start of a new themed month. Uh, we had pulled pork month last month. Can you guess what the new month is? That's right, it's pug month, right? Pug. No? It was close. Yes, pretty close to that. It is in fact mug month. We are doing four recipes using the power of a mug. Uh, so we're going to kick off uh, with a mac and cheese that will blow your mind. So, so simple. And a cat mug is essential, I'm afraid. So uh, check out this mug shop. <laughs> Excuse the pun right there. But that looks absolutely amazing. I promise you it tastes so, so good. It's very easy. It's very quick but a teeny bit dangerous. I'll explain as we go through the video. If you want to have a go at making this, hit pause on the video now, write them all down. Let me know at the end of the video, any mug recipes you want to see, this is how you want to do it. How you want to do it, this is how I did it. So the first thing you need to do is grab your mug of choice. And of course, a cat mug would be amazing. But if you can't get hold of it, don't worry about it. Uh, just add in some water and your dried macaroni into the mug and then whack it into the microwave. The microwave I'm using is an 800 watt one. If you've got a 900 watt, something stronger than that, it might take a little less, but we're aiming for six uh, minutes cooking time in total. Every single minute, we're gonna take that mug out. It will be hot, so be careful. Give it a little stir around to keep it all nice and moving. Keep your eye on the water level. We're only doing it for a minute because any longer than that, the water can bubble over. So every minute, take it out and give it a cheeky stir. And of course, keep your eye on the water level as well. You might want to top it up. Uh, that's basically it, really. You want to cook it through for the full six minutes until it's done. And once it is done, it should taste blooming nice. Well, as nice as plain macaroni can taste, it's soft though. Here comes uh, the tricky bit. So with our hot macaroni in the mug, we're gonna now add on our butter. So get that on there. It's niggly, as I say, it will melt through. And also add in your cheese. Uh, now what you wanna do is using a long spoon like what I've got is work it all the way down through there. It will take quite a long time. In fact, thinking about it, a quick way around it is to dump the ingredients out of your mug into a bowl and quickly add it through. But I did it the long way. Uh, add in all your cheese and then follow up with a little creaminess by adding on the milk. Give that a blooming good stir through and simply finish it off with a grinding of fresh black pepper and some red lesser cheese for a little bit of cheesy color contrast oh yeah baby guys it is such a stonker so easy and absolutely delicious loving the gooiness of the cheese as i say the only step to worry about is the water it's a little dangerous in the microwave so one minute increments will be fine breaking in the song there anyhow let me know down below what other mug recipes you'd like to see in this playlist and i'll do my best to accommodate your requests See you next time, guys, and check out my last video. Bye-bye.